God. God, I just did this. I just did that. No, it's not. God doesn't give grace and license in the sin. But God allowed things to happen. Trust the process. Where you are now gives you access to some people that other people can't get access to. You may be under me, but you're trying to figure why God have you in a situation so long. Go, why I get this home? Go, why I'm both here? Go, why some of my siblings? How do you know that the work that God wants to do in that home is not for that home? And He'll put you in there, He'll block you in there. He will lock you in there. And you can't move. Because you got to minister to them. You got to break some change. You got to break some chains of them. You got to break hey, some curses. You got to break some generation curse for their lives. And so he put you in that position. You said, God, I don't want to be here. Some of us in some homes, in some places, on some jobs, around some people that God wants us to minister to and wants us to be able to speak into their lives. Some of you don't even know that'll be the last time you speak to some people. Take it not strange. When God gave you a word, I don't care what you do. I don't care what you battling with. Do not let the enemy block you. I don't care what you battling with. What is going on in your life right now? Do not let the enemy block you. You're where you are for a reason. You're in the condition you're in for a reason. Some stuff are held up in your life for a reason. You're not moving as fast as you want to move for a reason. You're not getting delivered as fast as you want to get for a reason because God had you there for a reason. They got to trust the process. That's real. No, that's real. Sometimes you don't understand. You might think I should have been on this long time. I should have been from there a long time. Why should I have done this? I should have been finished with this. And you wonder why God doing it. You know how long I was trying to get this, yeah?